Welcome to this Big Picture and Big Gantt tutorial. In this video, we will discover how to make best use of this powerful project portfolio management plugin for Jira. Plan and structure your project and create programs and track deviations to manage your Jira tasks effectively. You are able to plan and manage your project, visualize dependencies, customize and manage aggregated data for both traditional waterfall and agile methodologies to get the big picture. You will always be kept up to date with information provided by your teams, therefore able to compare program plan with program execution. So, relax, you've found it. Let's get started. Big Picture Gantt and Big Gantt. Big Gantt is the most advanced module in Big Picture and is also available separately as a standalone plugin. It's a great tool able to help you manage not only your tasks, but also your portfolio. You should note that Big Gantt as a standalone plugin lacks some of the integration features available in the Big Picture Gantt version. The Gantt module consists of two main elements, a customizable list of tasks and a Gantt chart. One of the biggest advantages of our plugin is that most operations are made possible by simply using drag and drop. Such changes include, among others, changing the duration or dates of defined tasks, creating links between tasks, or changing the progress. Any changes are synchronized automatically and in real time. A really useful feature is that you are able to customize the fields that will be affected by using our plugin, such as the start date, end date, baselines, progress, or which links will be visualized on the Gantt chart. For more information about configuration of the Gantt chart, check out our plugin configuration video. We'll start with a quick overview of the Gantt interface. There are two navigation bars, the program level navigation, where you can switch between different programs, or click on one of the links to different big picture modules or program configuration. The other navigation bar provides options to manage your task list and the chart. Let's add a new task to our program. There are two groups of tasks which you can display using the Gantt chart. Jira tasks and subtasks and artificial tasks. Artificial tasks will be visible only on the Gantt chart, but not in your Jira project or other modules. They are great as placeholders for grouping your tasks by creating a structure or adding additional information to your chart. Data. If you want to sort or group your tasks, simply click on one of the available options. To sort by a specific field, make sure it is added in the Perspective section. Your task list is customizable. For more information, check out the Program Configuration Tutorial.
You can expand or collapse all tasks or specific levels in your task structure. To show the desired level of information, such as epic or project level. You can expand or collapse all tasks or specific levels in your task structure. To show the desired level of information, such as epic or project level. Our plan is ready. So let's create some baselines. Baselines can be used to show deviations from the plan. Once created, you can display them on the timeline and on the task list. The position of the task at the moment of creating the baselines will be shown with a transparent task bar. To add the baselines field to your task list, configure your perspective. Task Modes There are three modes available, Auto, Manual and Lock Mode. When Auto Mode is enabled, Parent Tasks the grey bars will be recalculated and tasks adjusted based on the dependency link used. In manual mode all automation features are disabled. Linked tasks and parent tasks will not be recalculated. The parent task actual position is still reflected by the grey bar. The red dotted line indicates the position after recalculation. Use the three dots icon to switch between different modes for selected tasks only. To prevent users from moving tasks on the Gantt chart, simply use the lock mode. View. There are some more features available after you press the View button. Perspectives. To customize your own view, configure your own perspectives to get only the information you need. Select Manage Perspectives and drag and drop the fields you would like to see on the task list. Note that there are some additional options available to display exactly what you want to see on the task list. Layout. You can change the layout of the list of tasks, compact, normal or wide. This is useful when exporting your Gantt chart to images. Use the navigation bar or keyboard shortcut X key to manage your Gantt chart and hide the task list. 
Use the period key to display the Quick Operations dialog box. There are more tools available, such as Critical Path, Markers and Baselines to manage your project. To add additional information or highlight a specific date on the timeline, enable markers and simply click on the timeline. The Gantt chart is integrated with other big picture modules, such as Roadmap. Enable cadences to display your sprint or cadence duration on the Gantt chart. Customize the colors of your tasks or use the Color by Status option. To edit your tasks, use the E key or switch to the detailed view. Detailed view has a WBS component for a quick peek into your structure. You can filter your tasks using different options, such as Fully customizable quick filters. This is an additional layer of JQL to hide tasks on the Gantt chart. Filtering by dates, also useful when exporting your Gantt chart. Search bar. Search the tasks by the summary fields using text search or entering JQL. To add your own quick filters, go to Program Configuration. Once added, they will be visible on the plugin navigation bar. There are several export options available in Big Picture and Big Gantt. These include image export in a variety of formats, as well as Microsoft Excel and Microsoft Project. Different file types are also supported.